get something off the ground. We need to hire people with experience to get this project off the ground. How would you fill this gap with English words that you already know? Which definition do you think matches this idiom? The correct answer is C. To get something off the ground means to start something happening successfully. We need to hire people with experience to get this project working successfully. Get the ball rolling. Employees got the ball rolling by raising funds for the project. How would you fill this gap using English words that you already know? Which definition do you think matches this idiom? The correct answer is B. To get the ball rolling means to start something. Employees started it by raising funds for the project. To get or be on the good side of someone or to get on someone's good side. I hope to get on my manager's good side by working overtime How would you fill this gap with English words that you already know? Which definition do you think matches this idiom? The correct answer is C. To be on the good side of someone or to get on someone's good side means to do or have done something to make them like you. Get on with something. I'm glad I could help, but I should get on with my own work now. How would you fill this gap with English words that you already know? Which definition do you think matches this idiom? The correct answer is B. To get on with something means to continue doing something after a break. I'm glad I could help, but I should continue my own work now. Give someone a pat on the back. Give her the pat on the back. It was her idea that got us the deal. How would you fill this gap using English words that you already know? Which definition do you think matches this idiom? The correct answer is C. To give someone a pat on the back means to congratulate them for doing a good job. Congratulate her. It was her idea that got us the deal.